Alright everybody welcome to another video and today you're gonna see how to play SCP Containment Breach Multiplayer LAN Offline with no internet. So step 1. Prepare PC for LAN gaming. First of all I'm just saying you could be an expert on LAN gaming and stuff which means you probably have connected your PCs together to play LAN games. If you are so you might skip this step and if you aren't an expert you're gonna need to do this one. I hate to say it but teaching how to prepare your PCs kinda takes too long and I'm pretty lazy to do that again. So please just click the link in the description and watch my previous video on preparing your PC for LAN gaming. Believe me this is important to do. Alright let's move on. Step 2 Download SCP Multiplayer. You can find this in the link in the description. Just to let you know that you don't need the original game for this. Because this is not an additional mod for the game. This is just the game with multiplayer applied to it. Ok now you can extract it and launch the game through this file. You can change the nickname from the multiplayer options. Just like this. Ok alright. Now to the step 3. Host a server. Before you host a server, you need to know the IP address of the host PC to connect the other client PCs to the server. So let's see how we find the IP address. First go to control panel. And then network and sharing center. Now you can see the details of your connection. Then you will see your IP address like this. Usually this shows as IPv4 address here. But in some cases you need to use the default gateway instead of the IPv4 address. I really don't know how exactly that works but I consider you try both of them if one didn't work. Now we need to copy both of them to somewhere you can see them later. So to host a server you need to open up the game then go to multiplayer and now host a server. Here you can set up your settings and uh, yep. Oh another thing you need to remember the port too. You should keep this where you copy the IP addresses. You will need this later. Now host. So the last step is connecting to the server. For this you go to the other PC and open up the game. Go to multiplayer and click this button that says direct connect. Now over here you can type in one of the IP addresses you copied from the host earlier. And here goes the port. Type those and you can hit connect. There we go. Now we can just press ready and start the server. So here we are playing SCP Containment Breach Multiplayer LAN Offline. Guess that's it for today's video. Hope you liked this. If you did give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, grab the subscribe button and turn notifications on. I'll see you in the next video.